Alrighty, everybody. Welcome back to Dan in the Dirt. First and foremost, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Stay busy, stay dirty. So, let's get into this. Y'all know I don't do too many show or movie reviews on this channel. I just got done uh, last night watching all of season one of uh, Twisted Metal. Um, it's on uh, Peacock. And, um,. Here goes. Uh, so, um, <clears throat> I thought uh, the show overall was pretty well done. Um, the acting was good. Uh, it wasn't uh, uh, a bunch of uh, woke propaganda uh, or anything to do with uh, with um, trying to propagandize kids or none of that nonsense. Um, <clears throat> um, the action was very good in the, in, in the show, that, in, in my opinion. Now, obviously, it's a show, so there's going to be a lot of dialogue, and I expected that. Um, uh, it was very... Uh, that was also uh, very well done. Um, the show gave me the Mad Max, Viggo Mortensen's The Road, and um, Walking Dead feel uh, to it. And, uh, you know, so... Uh, it. Uh, the way that uh, Sweet Tooth uh, is portrayed in the show, I thought was excellent. It was very well done. Um, um, anything that I guess I would consider uh, an awoke, anything woke or anything, must have it would have been subtle, like anything that would just be in a normal movie or a show. So it was overall that was all acceptable. Um, I watched all the all all the episodes in the, this first season that just came out. So, you know, if it would have had uh, a bunch of uh, stuff in it that I didn't like, I like like any of that woke crap or anything that that like is like propagandizing kids, I uh, I would have turned it off as soon as that came about. It would have it would have made angered me and I would have shut it off. But it didn't have that. The driving scenes were well done. I liked that they. I liked the way they did the vehicles because um, obviously uh, they weren't like cartoony or uh, you know what I mean. They like used like what are you. I would consider real vehicles, and then and then like uh, you know um, did the whole Mad Max thing to them. Um, so that was uh, all very well done, and I enjoyed it. Um, <clears throat> Uh, the action scenes were good. The acting was good, um, and the and the story itself, even though it was, it, it's a little bit of a slow burn to to build it up, but that's generally how a how a how a show works. The everything like the action scenes made it count. It was very very well done, and like the actual like um, twisted metal characters were well done. And the driving scenes were well done. Like, I really, really enjoyed that. And, uh, um, and I definitely think it's worth giving the show a chance. And let me know what you guys think in the comments below. What, whether you think it was, had, had a bunch of, uh, of some, some propaganda or another in it. You know, uh, I didn't hear, even hear any comments about I hate Trump or none of that other crap. Uh, uh, so, uh, but let me know, guys. Again, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. But my review overall, it was a very good show. I would give it an 8, eight out of 10 um, for the way it was done. And that's just the first season. Um, and uh, if all the other characters are represented the same way Sweet Tooth is throughout the show, the show's going to be uh, going to be uh, going up and up with that with my uh, review score uh on that, but the first season overall was very well done, and I think it was, it's worth the watch. And this is from somebody uh, who um, had the Twister Metal games when they very first came out, like out of the wrapper on um, PS One, and uh, and also PS Two, like with Twister Metal Black. Uh, I actually picked it up last night over the show. I liked it so much. Uh, I got the Twister Metal Black game for PS Four. I'll be streaming that over on Rumble. You'll find this video here on YouTube and over on Rumble as well, so don't forget to, to go over and follow me on Rumble uh, because my game streams uh, I'll be doing, um, at least for now, I think I'm going to do just like exclusively with uh, like with the game streams over there, and we'll see how things go. Um, but, uh, yeah, so... Um,
But anyway, uh, you'll find this review on both uh, Rumble and YouTube. And uh, you're going to find me uh, playing Twisted, Twisted Metal Black later this evening over on Rumble. So, again, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment, folks. Hopefully you all enjoyed the review. Twisted Metal is a very good show. Take care.